I paid almost $6,000 for this MacBook Pro, so let's open it up. And it's about time I've upgraded, because for the past couple of years, I've been slumming it with this 13-inch M1, which actually has been surprisingly good to me. It edits multiple layers of 4K footage effortlessly, and it's played every game I've thrown at it with aplomb, albeit it's just been Rollercoaster Tycoon Classic so far. But this will take performance to a whole new level, because it's got the 12-core Apple M2 Max chip with a bin 30-core GPU, 32 gigabytes of RAM and also two terabytes of storage. Honestly, those specs just sound incredible to me. So let's remove these tabs and open her up. And wow, these tabs look so much bigger than what you find on an iPhone box. <laughs> and now let's see how it looks. Three, two, one, and wow, look at that. She is so big. <laughs> okay, um, let's have a look at the laptop later. We have um, the documentation, which is um, all very exciting. Does it come with Apple stickers? Why, yes it does, it's got black ones. So we've got the 140 watt power brick over here, which is absolutely massive. Um, I mean, just look at that. It is a massive power brick. And we've also got the MagSafe cable. I'm so excited to have MagSafe again. And as we can see this year, it is color matched and also braided. <laughs> there we go. It's a braided cable now. And now let's unwrap the packaging. And oh my God. So it says a MacBook Pro on the bottom and it feels absolutely solid. As you can see, I got the silver color as scratches are less noticeable on it. And it is also the color that Steve Jobs would have preferred. So on this side, we've got an SD card slot, which I'm very excited to have again. Uh, USB-C, Thunderbolt, and also an HDMI, which I am slightly less excited for. On the other side, we've got MagSafe, two Thunderbolt 4s, and also a headphone jack. Let's see what she looks like on the inside. And inside we have, whoa, the, oh my God, it's already starting up. We've got the 16 inch XDR display with a notch and sadly, no touch bar. Man, I am going to miss the touch bar. Wow, that screen looks absolutely gorgeous. Let me know anything that you'd like to see on the new M2 Max MacBook Pro.